No matter where your journey takes you, the process will start by hitching up the all-new Cruise America Adventure Travel Trailer. Let's get familiar with key components you'll need to know to get your trailer ready for the open road. The trailer tongue, trailer ball, trailer latch, trailer crank, safety chains, brake line, wiring harness, tire chocks, and levelers. First, take a moment to ensure the levelers are up and stored in place. All hoses, cords, and debris are clear of the vehicle and trailer. Make sure to leave the tire chocks in place until the trailer is secured to the tow vehicle and ready to move. Use a guide to direct you back within a foot of the trailer's hitch. Raise the trailer with the crank until there is enough room for the ball hitch to fit under the trailer hitch. Remember to keep proper clearance. Align vehicle with trailer so the ball is directly under the coupler. Remove the safety pin from the ball clamp. Lower trailer tongue by using the trailer crank mechanism. Be sure the coupler is sitting nice and tight on the ball. When it is secure in place, you'll feel it click. Once secured, the ball clamp will be vertical. Don't forget to reinsert the safety pin. This trailer is equipped with hydraulic brakes, which are controlled by the brake line. Take the brake line and attach it to the towing vehicle's hitch. Next, attach the chains on each side of the hitch. Take the power cord for trailer lights and connect it to the vehicle. Use the adapter as needed. Use the trailer crank and ensure the trailer jack is moved all the way up to avoid bumps and objects in the road when driving. The correct setup will result in a level vehicle and trailer. Pro tip, the ideal height of the trailer should be 18 to 21 inches from the ground. Remove the tire chocks. Check to make sure nothing else is in the way. Remove as needed. Final checklist, check if the cord, chain, or hydraulic brake lines are dragging and at risk of touching the ground. If so, loop them around as needed. Please allow enough slack for turning. Check to see there are no compartments or debris in the path of the vehicle. Lastly, ensure all your signal lights are operational.